August 26. Comfortable or confirmable. In one of my radio messages, I made the statement, God does not expect us to be comfortable, but he does expect us to be confirmable. No sooner had the program ended than my office phone rang and an anonymous listener wanted to argue with me about the statement. Confirmable to what? The voice thundered. Haven't you read Romans chapter 12 verse 2? Be not confirmed to this world. Sure, I've read Romans chapter 12 verse 2. I replied, have you read Romans chapter 8 verse 29? God has predestined us to be confirmed to the image of his son. After a long pause, I was glad he was paying the phone bill. He grunted and said, okay. Comfortable or confirmable, that is the question. If we are looking for comfortable lives, we will protect our plans and desires, save our lives and never be planted. But if we yield our lives and let God plant us, we will never be alone but will have the joy of being fruitful to the glory of God. Verse for today. He that findeth his life shall lose it, and he that loseth his life for my sake shall find it. Matthew chapter 10 verse 39. Consider John chapter 17 verses 21 to 26, Romans chapter 8 verses 28 to 29, and chapter 12 verse 2. And be not confirmed to this world is the goal of those who wish to be confirmed to the image of Christ. Examine your lifestyle. If you find a comfortable rut that opposes your becoming confirmed to Christ's image, reject that rut. Through prayer and purposeful action, you can get out of comfortable ruts. Amen.